great song. What's the name of it? Don't you know this? What are you, Lavender Rock or something? Oh, I remember it now. Oh, sure. I, I love this song. It's a great song. I'm, you want to dance? Get it. I see. I used to be better at this. You want to dance? Me? Yeah. Sure. Well, let's go. I've seen the paper that you have a room for rent. We don't get very many kids here. Oh, well, I'm not a kid. I'm 17. Do you work? Well, I'm planning on going to Georgetown High. Oh, and then how are you planning to pay the rent? I'm independently wealthy. Oh, did you rob something? No, it's my father's money. He robbed something. Oh, oh I'm kidding. Well, I don't want any loud parties here. Oh, don't worry about it. I'm too old for that stuff. Well, come on in. I'll show you the book. But it's an all right with me now. I'll get you back up somehow. And with a little love, I'm bound to win. I'll fall in love. I'll fall in love again. Just like I left it. Well, 
I'd like to welcome you to Georgetown High. We're always happy to have new students. I'm happy to be here. Let's see, you're transferring. Uh, I trust you have your records. Records? Uh, no, sir. They were destroyed. School fire. It was a tragedy. I see. Uh, that's a problem. Perhaps you'd better have your parents come in to see me. That's impossible, sir. They're dead. Oh, I'm sorry. Um, well, Mick, I don't know what to do. Uh, I don't see how I can enroll you here under the circumstances. It's against regulations. But you have to. You see, it was my father's dying wish. He wanted me to go to the same high school he did. Your father went here? Yes. Maybe you remember him, Michael Riley? Michael Riley, of course I remember him. The resemblance is amazing. Mm. He was a fine young man. Yes, he was. I'm sorry to hear that he's passed away. He was a good student and an excellent athlete, too. How tall are you? Six one. Play much basketball? All the time. I think I might be able to do something. Come on, you slurp! Move it! I was told to see you about basketball tryouts. Too late, I've already made my cuts. Come on, Davis, get up there! Well, couldn't you make an exception? No! Maybe. You any good? It wasn't my day. What are we talking, uh, Pee Wee League? Just give me a chance. Get out there. versus Madison. Does anyone know what that case involved? Jeffrey, do you know the answer? Jeffrey. Present. <laughs> Try to stay with us, Jeffrey. Yes, ma'am. Do you know the answer? Do you know the question? Uh, what was the question? <laughs> Never mind. Uh, Michael. Want to give it a try? Let's see. Marbury Madison. <coughs> Wasn't that the one which set the precedent for judicial review? In other words, if a case is brought up before the Supreme Court, it has the power to overrule a decision on the basis that is unconstitutional. Basically, it clearly defined the separation of power set up in the Constitution. <laughs> Shot in the dark. 